Hello, this is Marfan Lover and this video is a demonstration of a possible configuration for the Headset Button Helper Tasker project. So, well, let's start by uh, plugging in my earphones. Okay, these are my earphones, microphone, and well, this. Now I will reroute the audio from. Okay, done from here, okay, from the earphone to the speaker of the smartphone, so you can hear. Okay, well, the project is capable of working with the screen off, and, and when it isn't on, and unlocked. So, let's test it. Okay. okay. Tell me, I'm ready. And if you wait without uh, pressing again the button, it will be cancelled. Operation cancelled. Okay. And if I unlock the device, it just continues working. Tell me, I'm ready. And a notification will be shown of the uh, showing. Operation cancelled. Showing the current action. Okay, let's start with the demonstration. So, uh, if you first, well, um, last comment. If you go to the setup task, you can see the second uh, parameter that is off or on. This is a second reaction that I decided to include within the project to configure uh, two different actions that you can perform when you long press the button. By default. It is, uh, it is directly linked with the parameter number 1 where you basically um, enumerate um, I don't know if, if this is correct in English uh, you just write all the actions that you want to configure within the project and if this is off and you long press the button uh, the this engine will uh, tell you every action you have configured within this parameter but if you set it to on not off on uh, a special well a second reaction will be performed that is configured from the helper actions task at the end you just need to go to the end okay end of task level and find this yellow level that is called secondary actions. This is an if condition, okay? And here you uh, you can configure the well the secondary action, okay? The second action that uh, that will be performed when this is set to on from the setup task and you long press the button. And an example, I as an example, I have configured it to call to the emergency services. But um, for the video, I I won't call to that number, obviously. <laughs> so I just uh, set a number for my phone customer service. Okay. Well, let's test the long press action, and this is off. Okay. Long press. Help requested. These are the available actions. One date and time. 2. Battery level. 3. Calendar events. 4. Call a contact. 5. Play music. 6. Stop music. 7. Start voice recorder. And 8. Stop voice recorder. Okay, now here, and as you could hear, these are all the actions that I have configured on my current device. And well, now let's start by testing all the single actions. So let's start with the first one, for example. Tell me, I'm ready. Now when the TTS when the TTS uh, tells you that you need to single click the operation cancel the button, okay? Tell me, I'm ready. Now first action. Date and time. Date and time. And it will be We are on Saturday, June twentieth, and it's two twenty three in the afternoon. Okay, it takes it just takes three seconds after each press just to wait for the next uh, press event. 
Now let's test the second one. Tell me, I'm ready. Date and time. Battery level. And this will tell you the battery. The current battery level is 77%. Okay, now let's let test the calendar event. This is uh, I can hear from here when I walk, uh, when I'm walking on the street all my events if I have one. So for example, today as an example I have created four possible um, events as an example. I mean uh, these are not real. So let's start. Tell me, I'm ready. Date and time. Battery level. Calendar events. Okay. These are four, not three, sorry. There are four events for today. This is event one. Go to supermarket. Buy the following items. Bread. Some water. Fish. Four potatoes. Meat. One kilo. This event will take place throughout the day. This is event two. Finish headset button helper tasker project. This is the deadline for the project. This event will take place throughout the day. This is event three. Send unsubscribe request. Send the request to customer.support at magazine.com before 12. This event will take place at 10 o'clock in the morning until 11.59 in the morning. This is event four. Call Mike. Call him to remember tomorrow's meeting. This event will take place at 5.30 in the afternoon until 5.45 in the afternoon. Okay, um, this were all the events I have created for the project. And as a comment, I, I have to... Well, I wanted to thanks to Blubleo's uh, Ratchet Guy uh, users from Reddit for the calendar-based task. Okay, so thank you. <laughs> Very good work. And now let's test the the next action that is to uh, um, a call to contact. Tell me, I'm ready. Date and time. Battery level. Calendar events. Call a contact. And this is okay. Please tell me how do you want to make the call? By number or by contact name? by contact. Now, tell me the name of the contact that you want to call. Phone customer service. The contact and its phone number are phone customer service 1470. May I proceed with the call? Yes. Okay, I'm dialing the number. And now start dialing. Of the number. Okay, so I will cancel and I rewrote the game because I have noticed that the the audio channel change, changes. Uh, sorry, but I. Oh, okay, yeah, the call has finished. Okay, now let's uh, test the the other way that you can dial a number. There is. Uh, Telling the number, not the contact name. Tell me, I'm ready. Date and time. Battery level. Calendar events. Call a contact. Okay. Please, tell me how do you want to make the call? By number or by contact name? By number. Now, tell me the phone number that you want to call. Okay, I will contact the same. 1470. Sorry, Oops. but I didn't understand it. Sorry. <laughs> Please, repeat the number slower. 1470. The number is... Okay, now yes. 1470. May I proceed with the call? You can cancel. Cancel. Okay, call cancelled. Okay. Uh, there are another actions 
but I will just test the, the last one that is to start the voice recording using my app well, well my, my app the, the app I have installed on my device that is Easy Voice Recorder so let's start tell me I'm ready date and time battery level calendar events call it contact play music stop music and this is start voice recorder and this section will start recording using this app starting to record voice and as you can see the voice has started the voice recording has started now i will stop it tell me i'm ready date and time battery level calendar events call it contact play music Stop music. Start voice recorder. Stop voice recorder. And it should be stopped right now. Voice recording has been stopped. And stopped. Okay, and I... Uh, I forgot to test the secondary action when you don't press the button, so I will show you here, right now. Let's go to the setup task and change the off parameter to on value, okay? And, I, and, I, uh, and as I have told you before, I have configured it to call to this number. I'm sorry if I make any mistake in English. <laughs> it's not my main language. Okay, let's test it. Don't press the button. Secondary action. Calling to the emergency services. Um, it is calling to the well, to the phone customer service, but if you configure it correctly, you should be calling to the emergency service. That here in Spain is one one two. Okay, and I have finished. Well, you just will reroute it back. Okay, speaker headphones. And when you unplug all the profiles are turned off automatically and as you can see all are turned off except the headset okay well i have finished the video demonstration if you have any question ideas or something else you can comment on the on my tasker profile center website or reddit or telegram group bye bye